Good day everybody, just wanted to give you an update on my uh, backyard garden here. Um, I since have moved from the old location and moved into the new location. Um, I am about an hour uh, north of where I was, uh, but I'm still in the same growing zone, which is uh, zone 4A. So anyway, let's go and have a look. So the garden here basically measures about... Um, 20 by 22. Um, this view here now what we're looking at is actually pointing uh, due east and as you can tell the sun is just uh, rising up in behind the uh, garden shed there now. Uh, in front of you you can see a couple of rain barrels that have yet to uh, hook up and over to your over to your left you can see that I do have a rain barrel already uh, hooked up to the uh, uh, to the rain gutters. Okay so this way here we are looking actually south and uh, in the background there you can see that I have uh, three compost bins uh, set up and, uh, and those will be used for of course composting. Uh, this picture here we're actually looking uh, west of the car or this is looking west. Uh, this is where the sun will be setting in the evening. And now of course you would uh, realize that this is uh, pointing uh, north. Uh, of course, over here I have the shot of the tomatoes to the left and to the right I have all the uh, green peppers. So of course this is one of the uh, beds that I'm redesigning. This one's going to be two feet wide by about uh, 16 feet long which should bring it uh, exactly all the way down to the uh, west end of the garden. Um, these are the beds that were here. Uh, there's really nothing wrong with them, but they're just not working for what uh, on, on how I garden. Uh, as you can see, I mean, they're just full of weeds, so it's been taking me you know, hours to clean these boxes out and then uh, get them get them moved. So over here we have the green peppers, these are cow wonder green peppers. And see one there with a little bit of a, a little bit of blemish starting on them. I'm not exactly sure what's going on. Uh, these are jalapeno peppers. And of course, in the background here is my uh, my Brussels sprouts which are growing in pot, so I really don't know how they're gonna turn out, but we shall see. Look closely, you can probably just start seeing the, the Brussels uh, just starting to form on the on the stem of that uh, Brussels sprout. Over here, these are uh, tiny Tim tomatoes. It will be quite a few of them. Here are uh, celebrity tomatoes. Uh, these are Manitoba tomatoes, which are actually doing pretty nice. It's the first time I've I've grown this style of tomato. It's, it's new for me. Uh, these are Starfire tomatoes. I've grown these for the last couple of years. They've been a pretty nice tomato and. Over here, I have my uh, the celebrity tomatoes, which have uh, really grown well for me. Um, just for the fun of it, I'm just gonna try a little bit of uh, fall planting. So, I've transplanted some uh, cylindra beets in here. Well, guys, that, that, that's it for now. I mean, things are coming along slowly, uh, it is a work in progress. Um, so basically, this is my uh, update for the month of July. Hoping to see you all again in the uh, in the month of August with uh, a new update, and uh, and uh, hopefully we I'll have all the beds done and and getting ready for for next year's growing. Anyway, take care, and we'll talk to you again.